Walk into the community room at Norwalk City Hall this week and you'll see a display of sculptures and a mix of hundreds of paintings, drawings and photography completed by students within the Norwalk Public School System. Each art teacher in the, the district chooses eight pieces. So what you're seeing here is a range from kindergarten through 12th grade. Norwalk's annual citywide art show kicked off Tuesday night, bringing together students and their proud parents and teachers to a gallery of student work. You can be creative and you can do whatever you like. I like how you get to make your own thing and you get to use different supplies. Nine works will be chosen to be framed and exhibited permanently in the third floor of the Ralph Sloan Gallery at City Hall. The nine pieces that you see a green dot on those are the, those are the uh, exhibits that I chose to be permanently framed and hung in the uh, Ralph, Sloan, uh, Ralph Sloan Gallery on the third floor here in City Hall. All of the other, uh, all of the other hangings will stay here so all the people of Norwalk, not only in City Hall, this room will be open to anyone to come in and really view some really creative work by young people. Other pieces were chosen by the Norwalk Housing Authority for potential use in its annual calendar. As you see the younger grades and they create something and you're thinking, gee, somebody in kindergarten or first grade did that? That's really great. And then you see first grade and second and third and right up the ladder and you watch how things start to grow and get better and better each year. About 40 pieces on display were chosen from Norwalk High School alone and teachers say within recent years a trend towards photography has become increasingly popular among students. What's interesting about the photography program at Norwalk is that it's black and white film photography. So the kids are still using the, the, the dark room, still developing and printing their own pictures. So it's actually really nice to see them engaged in a traditional Field. It causes you to like see things that you wouldn't see before because you'll like look at things and you'll be like, oh, that'd be a really good picture, and like you wouldn't have noticed it otherwise. The work I've done was based on New York, people of New York, and try to catch what's on the what, li what lays on the sideline mostly, not what you see every day or hear about on the news. The little people that no one actually acknowledges. In Norwalk, I'm Priscilla Lombardi for It's Relevant News.